Hi, welcome back to Kokuni Khan and it's German. Please like, share and subscribe to see more upcoming videos. Palya polo or leaves dosa is a popular Kerala GSB dish, usually eaten for breakfast or as an evening snack. It is really tasty and quite nutritious too. With just one basic batter, you can add a variety of green leaves giving each polo a distinct taste. Since this is made with fresh leaves, its nutritional value is unquestionable. Leaves used for this include drumstick or masinga sange patti, which is the most popular, chopped arabi leaves or mandya pan, chopped cabbage, kodvi, coriander leaves, sambar chira, english chira or methi leaves. The ingredients for the basic batter or pita are shown here. 3 cups of raw rice. You can also substitute 1 cup raw rice with 1 cup boiled rice. 6 to 7 red chilies or more as per your spice tolerance. Half of a large coconut. A piece of tamarind the size of a gooseberry. 1 teaspoon hing, half teaspoon turmeric powder and salt to taste. Now add water to the rice and let it soak for 3 to 4 hours. Wash the soaked rice and drain the water. Now add the chilies to the grated coconut in a mixer jar a part of the rice and the tamarind. You can also use star fruit, karmbal or tree sorrel, bimbul or hog plums, ambado for soreness. Now grind this to a smooth batter adding water as needed. Transfer to a bowl and grind the remaining rice to a smooth batter. Add the ground rice also to the bowl. Now add haldi powder, hing and salt to taste and mix well. The consistency should be like the usual dosa batter. Your basic batter is now ready to be used. I have divided it into two parts to make cabbage polo and masanga sange patte polo. You can add chopped cabbage, chopped mandya pan, chopped coriander leaves, drumstick leaves, and chop kurvi leaves also. Mix the sorted and washed drumstick leaves with one part of the batter. a tawa to medium hot and pour a ladle of the batter. Spread it out, pour a spoon of oil over it and cover it. Let it cook for a little while, then flip it over and let it roast. You can roast the dosas to a crispy texture by keeping on a low flame for a longer time or have them soft without roasting long.
The polo is now ready. Mix finely chopped cabbage with the second part of the batter and make cabbage polos in the same way. While serving, add a spoon of coconut oil to enhance the flavors. Enjoy these polos as such or with your favorite chutneys, pickle, tomato sauce or just plain coconut oil. For more details, refer to our website kkaj.in.